All righty, welcome. As this is now the 14th, I believe, yeah. Thir uh, 11, 12, 13, 14. So today's the 14th, and we are getting ready to start our new OP, which is the West, it's OP2, the um, Westward Experience, or Westward, and the Native American Experience. I apologize. It's Friday, it's the end of the day. But I want to get into we only have four days total on this OP before we're going to move on to the next one. So uh, the Kim chart is what we're going to start today. You need to immerse yourself in the text. And that means perusing and reading as we get through, because we're only going to have about two days of work on it before we get our final day of the, uh, the assessment. So uh, make sure that you are immersing yourself in the text, not just perusing it, but there's a lot of ideas that are carried through. Uh, but one of the major points that I want to point for this one, excuse me, let me present now. So we're going to go through. Okay. Okay. Yes. Share. So um, we're presenting the screen and that's what we're looking at. Make sure you are filling out the definition and the visual memory clue. It is very important that you put the visual memory clue in there. It does not have to be anything specific, a Picasso drawing. It is something for you to use to memorize what the Dawes Act was. This is an example, that first one. Write with the definition of the Dawes Act, all right? And so you're going to put that in there, and then whatever you need, to help remember exactly what the Dawes Act was, all right? Nobody is going to laugh at your drawing or to grade it. This is specifically for you to help pull that information when it comes back. When you see the Dawes Act on the, uh, the test, it's going to help you go, oh, hey, that's what it was, all right? So do not... Make it too crazy or complicated. This is really, these chem charts are designed specifically for you to help retain this information. All right? So um, enjoy this. this is all we're going to be doing on Monday. It's going to be immersion in the text and the chem chart. All right? The chem chart's not going to be in due, uh, will not be due until the 17th. But do not wait to the last minute. Knock it out. There's approximately 11 pages of text here, but there's a lot of imagery. So do not worry. When I say 11, don't think, oh, my God, it's 11 pages, and then you're crazy. Nope. It's 11-page text. Uh, study the graphics, but enjoy the text. There's a lot of information going on here, and we are going to progress very fast through here. So, but if you have any questions, make sure you're emailing me. The Google Meet chat will be up on Monday, so all you have to do is hit me up. If you're having any issues, make sure you are emailing me, okay? Other than that, I will see y'all in the chat. Till then, see you next time. <laughs>